Human traffickers in Guyana are set to face stiff penalties under new legislation passed in the National Assembly. The 2023 bill replaces the 2005 legislation protecting the rights of individuals and providing punitive measures. Anybody who commits the crime could face five years in prison for a summary offense. Conviction on indictment carries a penalty of life imprisonment. Minister of Human Services and Social Security Dr. Vidya Persuade added that there will also be significant penalties for conspiracy or complacent acts of trafficking. She said the legislation aims to deter potential offenders. The objective of this bill is to prescribe measures to combat trafficking in persons, including children. And it sets out a litany of criminal offenses with extraterritorial effect. And this extraterritorial effect facilitates partnership and cooperation between Guyana and other states to prevent and suppress trafficking in persons. And of course, it gives a wider scope to punish offenders. The Attorney General added that restitution is an approach that must be persuaded to hurt perpetrators of human trafficking. Restitution is a legal method for victims to get compensation for profits that traffickers withheld from them, additional losses they might suffer, and costs they incur in the future because of being trafficked. If you hit the criminal in the pocket, if you hit the criminals financially, and you hit them economically, you are going to eventually hurt them. So in anti-money laundering offenses, in terrorism, in the trafficking of firearms, in the trafficking of narcotics, and in the trafficking of human trafficking, you find that that concept has been embraced fully in this bill.